in today's video, we'll be answering your questions. Completing Series 2 And finally, we'll be upgrading our display box. Our first question comes from William Peeler. Are you gonna post a link where to get the knockoff Optimus? They are not Creole Creons, so what are they? Please and thanks, Link. Okay, I'm gonna show you exactly where I got these but in order to do that, we need to get out of the house and we need to drive down to Pearl Ridge. It is Oahu's second largest shopping center and it is so big that it even has a monorail to go from one end to the other. So let's get inside and our first stop is gonna be Razor Concepts. This is a really cool store. They have everything you could think of and they also have a huge selection of fake Lego or as we call it, Fago. As you can see here. And the other place we go to for Lego is about 10 stores down. It's called Animation Magic and they also have a nice collection of Fago. So that's where we get our fake Lego. Next question comes from Mr. Mixup. Slash Shot comes with Battle Max's head and he has Aximus's head. Okay, that's not really a question, but I wanted to throw that in here because I did not know that Battle Max and Aximus had the same head. I had to run out to the workshop. I busted out Slash Shot and Battle Max, and it took me a while just to figure out these two guys had the same head. But then I also busted out Aximus, and it is true. All three of these guys have the same head and it's a little hard to tell at first because the paint job is so unique on each of them that it's not that obvious that it's all the same head, but it is all the same head. When you spin them all around, you can tell. And I did not know that. And I just wanted to include that in here. So thank you for that observation, Mr. Mixup. That is something new that I didn't know. And our last question comes from Scott though. There's a new giant coming in Akito season three. And do you still have all the giants? So as all of you know, in our last video, we took Drillborg and we turned him into Dr. Eggman, as you can see right here. Moose Toys sent us these four battle giants, but it's not a complete set. They sent us two Tonks. So we're missing the drill board, but luckily I had bought in two sets. So I do have an extra of all of them, including the four that Moose Toys sent me. So I'm gonna bust open this drill board just so we have one for our collection in case we wanna do a tournament or battle him and test him out. And we cannot mess this one up because this is our last drill board. We do not have any more. They're very hard to get right now, as you guys all know. So to answer your question, yes, we do have another drill board. We have the complete set. Just recently in the mail, we had gotten something that we have been waiting a long time for. 
It is the final Akedo Series 2 Versus pack that we needed to complete our set. And here it is, guys. It's the Versus pack that has Kragnox and Power Corn. So let's bust that open and check them out. Okay, so let's check out Kragnox here. He looks very similar to He-Man. There's only one thing that is obviously different between this guy and He-Man is that he more has the body of Barney Rubble than He-Man. I don't know why they did that. He would have looked a lot better if they gave him a muscular build, but for some reason, they gave him that body type and that's fine. We love him, his weapon is awesome. I did not test him out, but he looks like he can do some damage. And next we have Power Corn who is really nice. I really like this guy. He has a one of a kind head. As far as I know, I think it's one of a kind. And his sword is really awesome. So it's gonna be fun to see what he can do. Let me know down in the comment section, guys, if you wanna see a, a Kato Series 2 tournament. And then also let me know if I should feature the Battle Giants in that tournament. So what I'm gonna do here, guys, is I'm gonna put Power Corn on the inside and I'm gonna put End Code on the outside in this slot. And there is our full set of Akedo Series 2. And last, we have our complete Akedo collection. We're moving everything over to this big display box that doesn't even fit on my countertop. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with this thing, but I'm gonna fill it with all of our Akedo Series 1, all of our Akedo Series 2, the Battle Giants, and last, all of our custom warriors, starting with Stormstrike with his two frozen maces. Next is our OP Pride Heart with his extra big sword and his massive shield. Then we did Bruce Lee, who's a puncher with a blocking arm, first of its kind right there. Next, we did Carnage with that big spike hand and his tentacles. And Venom, who is our current customs champion. Then we did the Grinch, who's the first puncher and kicker. Then we did Iron Spidey, whose weapon is one of his Spidey legs. Next we did Miles Morales who has a web shooting out of his wrist as his weapon. Then we did an Among Us, and I still have not fixed his weapon. Then we have the Xenomorph with his tail as his weapon, and he proved to be deadly. Next, we did the Super Akedo Bowl, and there we have Big Stinky in his Bengals helmet, and Crack Up in his Rams helmet. Then we have our Predator figure. And to battle the Predator, we made Dutch covered in mud with his torch. And there we have Optimus Prime, and it is not too late to enter the giveaway, guys. There is our Batman Kicker. And Sonic the Hedgehog with his sword. And our last and most recent customization is Dr. Eggman. And there is our collection, guys. It is massive. I can't wait for Series 3 to come out. There's a little bit of room for them. And guys, wait a minute. I forgot our rarest figure of all, our Stormstrike right there that we got 
on camera and we're gonna put them right there guys and thank you all so much for watching our video to the end don't forget to enter our Optimus Prime giveaway and if you like the video then subscribe hit that like button comment down below anything you want to see ask us any of your questions we'll definitely answer it and we just might feature it in one of our videos and please feel free to click one of the links popping up on your screen right now and we will see you in the next video